And welcome back guys, welcome back to Resident Evil Code Veronica X. Uh, hopefully this is the exciting conclusion of the game. So I figured out what I needed to be doing, and we're actually going in the right direction. And a friend of mine also told me that, um, I'm going to be, it's going to be me this entire time. It's not going to be Claire that faces him. So, with that happening, I need to load up on everything as far as that goes. Um, because, do I even have the Magnum? Did I even get the Magnum? Oh yeah, I do have the Magnum. What am I talking about? Alright, um... I'm trying to think. Uh, I'm not going to use the handgun really anymore because pretty much this is end game. There's nothing else to worry about. Um, I'm trying to think of everything I need to bring with me. Ah, shit. You know what, I know what? I'm going to substitute the flame rounds because that's not really a Noel weapon I'm going to use. And I can combine those with those. Uh, machine gun for sure. Um... Is that everything I want to do? Because this is it, guys. This is, this is the end. Eh? Oh, assault rifle rounds. All right, let's do a little bit of uh, consolidating first uh, before we even continue anything else. All right, so I should be able to... No, why did I go back to the box? All right, sorry. Combine, get that. That's 99%. And that's 25 shots for that. And that's fully loaded. I don't have any other health items on me. Because I don't want to die. But I'm not, yeah, I'd take that. Now the shot I mean the shotgun's good, but why, why do I need it? I, re I really don't. No, that's pretty much it. So actually thinking about it. Um, I need to put something away. I'm sorry. I just need to. I hate, I hate to say it, but I have to put one of these away. And I should be fine like that because I got to grab a couple things. Now, what you want to do is you want to go over here and turn off the power. And, um, how do I turn off the power again? Oh, yeah, right here. So, turning off the power, do you remember where the tiger statues were at? Uh, where the tiger statue, rather, is at? We need to get the gems out of there. Because do you remember the rooms that were like the room in the private part of the Ashford, um, thing? That's where you got to go. I'm trying to think of how to do this. Uh, the quickest way to get through. Because there, there is a way you can get through. But, um, yeah, we gotta get the... We gotta put things into things. And this should be open now that the power is off. Yeah, I should be able to get through here because I unlocked it from the other side. Didn't I? Pretty sure I did. But then again, I could be wrong. Biohazard symbol. Is there not a... Do I not have a card? Let me check this out. Security card. Where do I get the biohazard card from? Hmm. That's a knife. Huh. Well, this isn't good. Where do I get the card? Let me go... Let me go up these stairs really quick. Because I'm, uh... Oh, maybe it's in here. Let's make our way around. It can't be too far. I don't think it'd be any place uh, in the past. This is one of the rooms I need to go into. Let's look at our map real quick. And that room is... I'm not 100% sure, but I'll figure it out. No, I don't think it's in here either. I mean... Unless it's in here. Is this it? Oh, that was on a fucking whim. That was on a whim. I totally didn't even know that was there. Just something drew me to that room. Alright, well now we've got what we need, actually. That, that's good, because I didn't want to waste your guys' time any more than I had to. Alright, so let's go back to... This says sterile room key. Was that the only... I could I have sworn that's the only door that said something about a biohazard symbol carved on the door. So... That being said, it should probably be where we need to be going. Oh, yeah. Alright, well, well, single use for the key. Alright, we're doing good. It's been a bit since I've played this game, and it's refreshed in my mind, so... Okay, now the power is off. Now, I needed to have two item slots, because now that the power is turned off, we can take both these gems. I'll take both. Thank you. And the right one, respectively. Alright, now, 
we need to go back to the rooms that are uh, Alfred's and Alexia's that were kind of like the mock rooms of their room in the private house on Rockford Island. And like before, we put, it's kind of like getting the uh, the ant objects, both the queen and the king or whatever, what have you. And we got to put it back in there. And then I'm thinking it's probably going to lead us up to the top again and we're going to get that butterfly object thingy connected to the thing. And then we can go to that main... Oh, Jesus Christ almighty. What in God's... No. What was that? Uh-huh. No. Stop it. All right, now I'm just being a little bit, a little bit careless. Cause I didn't think these there was gonna be zombies here. See, I didn't pick up a handgun. This is what happens. Now I gotta kill you. I don't have the knife either. Well, that kind of pisses me off. If there's like a single green herb, that'll be great. But yeah, where did they all come from? I was just in that hallway. All right, you know I know whatever. Okay, so this is the red one. So, all right, well, let's go ahead and put the red ruby object in there. It got very quiet in here too. Alright, let's go ahead and take the music box plate. And uh, go to the other room. I think it's only on one side is where you can go up, and that's Alfred's study. If, if I'm uh, if I'm correct in all of that. Yep. Alright, so. Slap that in there. Yes, I know it's open. Thank you, Chris. It's too damn quiet here. And just like on the other island, brings that down where you could get crushed, and that would be scary as hell, and it'd be your death, and that would be it. All right. Oh, no, Chris, get back on the bed, thank you. I mean, those zombies. I should have. I just don't. I just can't justify using a, a machine gun on all of them. But I thought that would have been it. Grabbed what I need to grab, and I think there'd be you know more enemies other than like what would be the last enemies. Please be nothing up here. That would be quite annoying. Oh that, oh, that camera change really scared me a bit. What is this? Nothing useful. There's something up here. Oh, yeah. This is what I need. So I guess this room isn't uh, the same as the other one. So we can combine these two. And now we have the gold dragonfly, which we use uh, up at the thing to start the self-destruct sequence. And oh, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I'm gonna just use a single one of those. Hopefully, it doesn't put me, it puts me back on fine. Okay, all right, we're good. Now, I'm wondering if I should go back to the save room. Is there anything else in here? No, I think that's it. Now we gotta go back up to the platform where, uh, what's his butt is at? Or what her butt is at? And, um, do what I need to do. All right, oh, I'm gonna walk around this side because I, I think I killed the zombie that was on this side, and hopefully I can get back to the main area where I need to be before anything happens. Oh, you're right there, I know. I just might as well just floor him. He's dead as dicks. Alright, that room is the room. Well, you know, I'm on the opposite side. What am I doing? Just stay down. Which room is the room I needed to go into? You know, I know it's not even down this hall. Alright, so, we need to go in here. This is it. Now, is there... I can't remember if there's an item room. I don't really think there is. But I do need to start the self-destruct sequence, but how do I do that? Um, well, I know how to do it. I'm just wondering if I just gotta put that thing into into the, um... We'll see. Let's, let's just look and see, because I'm pretty sure that's what I gotta do. I'm um, back here. You wanna know there's an item box? I'm gonna go and make the best of it and grab as much as I can. I have pretty much everything I need, but um, just to be safe, let's grab. Did I get hurt again? No. I, I don't think I let anything grab me. Alright, so I can grab this final, final first thing like that, and that's pretty much all I've got to use, guys, as far as... I do have some submachine guns, but I feel like the assault rifle is the better of the two. But we are... This is definitely going to be endgame. I can feel it. Might as well be. 
I may have to split it into two parts, but... Because I know there's an extra ending at the end of this. Alright, I came from that door, so I gotta go out this way. And this should, yeah, we're gonna... It's gonna be it. Gotta love those audio glitches, not gonna miss those. Press the zombie hasn't decided to burst out. Oh, it's getting... it's getting scary. I should have, should have saved, but I wasn't really that close to a save box. Alright, let's put it in. Return and unlock the door. And this is probably where it's all gonna go down. So, in that case, since it's probably gonna go oh, I hear zombies. Wait, no, don't go back to that, go this. Yeah, come on. I don't want to have to do that, but you've really given me no choice. Oh yeah, self-destruct sequence. Alright, well, oh, there's a bunch down there, too. Oh, there's a green herb here, too. Well, let me get rid of this key really quick. Yes, you put in the security card. Into the slot. Oh, it's gone quiet. Self-destruct sequence. Please enter the security code. And the security code is... Veronica. Nick. Ha. Veronica. Verification in progress. And it's code Veronica. I mean, that should be self explanatory. Alright. Sweet. Are those like nukes? Five whole minutes, eh? All those zombies down there are gonna be pissed. Right, so now I got five minutes to get out of here. And I got another herb, which is nice. So yeah, let's uh let's get out of here. Hi fellas. Don't be throwing up on me. No. Stop, stop, stop. Is there any more? Nope, I think that's it. Alright, let's get out of here. It's gonna be the final final countdown. Ah, uh, there you it goes. Made it. Of course. Come on. Let's get out of here. Uh oh. You. She's got pooped out. What are we gonna do? Oh, the linear launcher. Okay, turn the key clockwise simultaneously on three. Got it. You better be quick about that. One, two, three. Uh-oh. So basically what you gotta do is you gotta fight her I'll off with your normal. Busy. Just go for the emergency elevator! Chris, but I can take care of this. Just go. You have to make it. Don't die on me. Basically you have to fight her with your normal weapons until the linear launcher is ready, then you fuck her up. So Oh shit. Oh yeah, don't let her kill Claire either, that's what you gotta do as well. Oh yeah, look at that. Magnum shot. That's all? Well, that's definitely not her final form. Not to be cliche or anything, but... Yeah, now she's a dragonfly. A gross, gross, gross dragonfly. Lots of legs. And ginormous chest. Oh, hey. Beautiful. She is gonna fight me, and I'm gonna fight her back. Let's do this. Oh. Game. Game. Don't do this. Okay. I'm gonna say, game, don't freeze on me now. Alright. Just unload it. Let's load it. Let's just unload it on her. Now, she's not too much of a trouble. It's her little helpers that you gotta deal with. 
Well, we are getting her. Oh, is, is that really is that really all? Oh, I'm poisoned. Sweet. Let's do the grub this. Get out of the fucking way. Holy shit. Oh my good god. She is fucking me up. Wow. Well then. That happened. Alright, sorry about that. I'm back. Let's be a little bit more conscientious with this one because we got a little bit fucked up. Her helpers like fucked us up that time. We gotta fuck them up too because they... Yeah, I don't even know how I fucked... Yeah, those things are just fucking me up. I really don't want to die. Holy shit. Oh my god, again! Holy shit! Alright, finally to this part at least. It seriously took so many shots, I just got into a corner, shot with an assault rifle and the magnum. Now hopefully her little helpers don't come, because I think I have one healing item left. And now she's going to take to the sky. Hopefully nothing's going to be attacking me at this point, but... I'm poisoned, but this is the end. I didn't... I should be fine. Ugh, that's gross. Literally took all of my machine gun and all of my magnum. And I'm almost done with health items, too. But, now this is ready to go. So, I'm gonna heal one last time. But now she's a big flying thing. You pretty much just gotta... Yeah, I'm hurt. Oh, I don't have any healing items. This might be the end. Take this real quick. Yes. Alright, let's, uh... Let's use this. So you pretty much just gotta... Please don't kill me, for the love of God. Oh shit. If this killed me, I'd be pissed. Oh god. Oh, come on. Oh, and it killed me, my god. This is gonna be ridiculous, guys. <sighs> Thank you, god. Holy shit. You better run. How did he not get fucking torched there? Oh my god, you do not know how much I've done off screen. <laughs> Chris! Move. Clear! No! Now this isn't in X, actually. This is or in the first one, this is actually all new. So I'm going to be quiet for this. Ooh, yeah. Chris! Well done, Chris. It turns out that Alexia's work wasn't much of anything. So now, the only thing left is revenge. Let her go, Wesker! You don't want her. Fine. Claire! Today, I came for Alexia, but killing you is even better. Sorry to disappoint you, but Alexia is gone. That's no longer a concern to me. I have Steve to work with. Steve? What? Steve. In the, there's still a living T. Alexia virus. Steve should be a good specimen. Maybe he'll come back alive just as I did and be able to see your sister again. You freak! Don't you touch him! I'm sorry, dear heart. But my men have already taken him. You get out of here. What about? As a surviving member of Stars, I have to finish this. Remember your promise. I'll end this once and for all. Say hello to my comrades who have killed. I don't know where you get your confidence, Chris. Oh shit.
<laughs> Hope I don't have to fight or anything, because I put my controller down. Oh wait, shit. Do I have to fight him? Because I'm like dead. And if I have to do everything again, the I'm just gonna kill myself. System has been activated. All personnel evacuate immediately. The self-destruct system has been activated. All personnel evacuate immediately. Yeah. Evacuate. God, that was like the hardest fight in a very long time. Fuck him up, Chris. Sure, I'm not human anymore. But just look at the power I've gained. Ooh. Damn, Chris. You're getting fucked up. Do it. Ooh. You just got beamed. Better get out of there, Chris. Don't think beams fucked him up. Nice try, Wesker. Ooh. Oh, damn, pizza on your face, bruh. He's found the opera. Them sounds, and the next time they actually do meet is in uh, what is it? Some sort of DLC for Resident Evil 5. Lost in Nightmares tackles Jill through the fucking window. Chris, where are you? See, normally in this Code Veronica, this is where it would end. Or Chris would just go down and this would be it. It wouldn't have had that extra sequence at all. So that's... Wesker wasn't even in the normal Code Veronica at all. Ooh. Chris! How is he not burned? Hey, you know that I always keep my promises. Oh my god. <laughs> Chris, promise me. Please promise that you won't leave me alone again. I'm sorry, Claire, but it's not over yet. There's still something we've got to do. You mean... Yeah, it's payback time. We've got to destroy Umbrella. Now, let's finish this once and for all. Hells yeah. Sweet. Well, that's Resident Evil Code Veronica X. And I'll see you guys after the credits.
Alrighty. Is it just me or did that outro seem a little grainy to you, like as far as the text and everything went? Oh my god, that last fight. Honestly, all I did was go into the left hand corner. God, look how fucking big Chris's shoulders are. Basically, I went into the left hand corner and just aimed up with the grenade launcher a bunch, shot, shot, shot until I ran out of that, then shot with the magnum. And the whole linear launcher, that was a fluke. I was just about dead. But uh, yeah, I am probably have a low rank, so let's. Uh... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I wasn't expecting to do good on this, guys. I know how I like to boast that I'm a Resident Evil fanatic, which I do love Resident Evil. I love all the games. I know a lot about it. But this is a game that I've honestly have only beaten maybe twice. I've not. I get to the point where I'm with Chris, the shit starts getting hard, and I never finish it. So this is really one of the only first times that you guys have actually seen me play. It took me eight hours to beat. We got a D, 19 saves. I saved just for the benefit of of, of just you know. I have to, because I wouldn't have saved that much, but for video's sake, I have to each time. Um, but yeah, a number of retries, a lot of them were from, God, at least half of those were from the final boss. I probably got next to nothing for that, but we unlocked the battle game, which I'll probably show you guys in, in the next video. This video's already gone on long enough. You see, now I got the battle game, but I won't show that till the next time. Um... I'm going to the option menu just so I can go to the demo screen. Let's talk about the game for a few. All right, so this um, was probably one of the longer of all the Resident Evil games. Um, we're talking about the survival horror, not 4 or 5 or 6 or anything like that. Those are shit. 4 is fine, though. I, I have no beef with 4. But um, I really do enjoy this game. It's definitely what the, where Resident Evil died, so to speak. I know they came out with a remake in Zero. Um... But I like this one. This is probably my second or third favorite um, Resident Evil game. Uh, you don't see Claire again uh, for a while after this game. Up until recently, a trailer came out for Resident Evil Revelations 2 where she's actually in it. But you don't see her for a while. Uh, Steve, you never see again. You know they said they took him, but you never see Steve again. Um, Chris, of course, comes back in 5. Um, but yeah, um, I really enjoyed this game a lot. Um, bit difficult, um, but overall uh, Capcom did very well with this game. But um, yeah, if you guys want to tell me how I did, what I could have done better, if you guys think you can do better, which you can, I got a D rank, you know, post a video response or something like that. But yeah, um, that is the end for me. And yeah, this has been Resident Evil Code Veronica X, and I have been the Leviathan. And I'll see you guys in the next game I play. Thanks for watching, guys.